Hey, what's up guys? Lego Kid here and I'm back with another set reveal video to talk about and earlier today The Lego group has officially revealed all of the new upcoming Lego Monkey Kid 2022 sets and all of these sets will be coming out on January the 1st as of 2022 which is in about a month in a few weeks so anyways the first set to start out this list is set number 80030 and also called the Monkey Kids Magic Machines. Now this set will be retailing for about $30 to $40 in US. This set will also contain 309 pieces along with two minifigures. One of them being the Monkey Kid and also the Monkey Cane. And these minifigures both have, I believe, new torso print and leg printings. So anyways, next up we have set number 80031. And also called Mii's Dragon Car, Maya's Dragon Car. I probably said that name wrong. But anyways, this set will be retailing for about uh, $40 to $50 in US. This set will contain 456 pieces along with four minifigures. Two of them are bad guys. One of them is named Rumble and the other is named Savage. And the good guys here, one of them is Monkey Kid, which is the main character. And the other one is me. So next up we have set number 80032 and also called Shaney's, I probably said that name wrong too, Shaney's Moon Cake Factory. Now this set will be retailing for about uh, 50 to $60 in US. This set will also contain 609 pieces along with four minifigures. <clears throat> One of the minifigures is um, Ma, which is the cat. Uh, the other one is Pigsy, the Pig Chef, uh, the Lunar Rabbit Robot, and also Shaney's or Shane's. And next up we have set number 80033, and this set is called Evil Macaquiz Mech. I probably said that name wrong. Um, Evil Macaquiz Mech, and this set will be retailing for about 60 or no, 70 to yeah probably 70 dollars in us this set will also contain 893 pieces along with five minifigures one of them is uh evil macaquee and the bad guy is rumble we have sandy in a um, miniature minifigure form along with may and also monkey kid as well next up we have send number 80034 and also called uh, Niza's, I probably said that name wrong again, uh, Niza's Fire Hoop. Now this set will be retailing for about uh, $80 to $90 in this set, or uh, $80 to $90 in the US, I said that wrong. And this set will contain 929 pieces, along with six minifigures. One of them is the um, evil Macaque, and there's a bad guy named savage and there's also another queen white bone demon and we have monkey cane monkey kid and also nazaha or <laughs> i said that completely wrong naza so next up we have uh set number 80035 and this is called monkey kids discovery spaceship now this set will be retelling for about uh, $100 in US. This set will contain 1,356 pieces, along with seven minifigures. Two are bad guys. One of them is Rumble and Savage. And we have a few good guys. One of them is Robot Ma. And we have Sandy, Mr. Tane, me, and also the Monkey Kid. All of them are wearing spacesuits. And the final set I actually find interesting out of this entire wave, and I also find it phenomenal. This set is set number 80036, and this is also called City of Lanterns. Now, this set will be retailing for about $150 in the U.S. This set will contain 2,187 pieces, along with seven minifigures. <clears throat> now, this set I find super phenomenal and super interesting out of this wave of monkey kid i really want to just add this and get this set and put it in my lego city for real so anyways those are all of the new upcoming monkey kid sets and some of these sets i i kind of find uh weird in a way like the builds are kind of out of context i mean the build the builds are awesome but the set itself is out of context like 
uh, let's say the, yeah, the Fire Rain. I mean, that vehicle looks awesome. I like the design for it, but the vehicle itself or the build itself is just out of context, really. And also the, uh, what is this? The Shaney's Mooncake Factory. This one is just super weird with a robot mech along with just this cake factory and a mini spaceship that looks like a missile for some reason. I don't know, but the rest of these sets are pretty interesting. I probably won't pick up any of them, but either way, these sets are super awesome. I also love that new missile mode for the dragon car as well, and the minifigures are also pretty new and also very awesome to this wave of Monkey Kid. So overall, these sets are pretty awesome, and the one set I really do enjoy is the City of Lanterns. That one is a huge set. It kind of reminds me of Ninjago City a little bit, and also I want to just get this set and put it in my Lego City because everything about this set is super awesome with the, um, what is it, the monorail along with all of the buildings, the Lego store as well. Man, I love this set. I wish I could get it. I mean, I maybe will. I don't know. I'm not planning on it. But either way, this set looks awesome. And all of the rest of these sets are pretty good as well. So anyways, that is it from me for today. Please make sure to subscribe, like the video. And yeah, I'll see you all in the next one.